Hello! Today we're going to talk about uh, using an image for your button. So you can have a cute little button. Now I found this wonderful picture of a cat. And so I took a screen snip of that cat and I saved it in the same file that my program is in. So my program, I can look and it's, I'm on my uh, laptop so it's going to look different on your Raspberry Pi. But uh, I made sure that I put the, the screen snip in the same file that my program is in. That's important. So now it's pretty easy. Uh, now we just, I would change the name of your image so it's something short and sweet. Uh, I called mine cat.png. And you need the dot whatever type of file it is at the end. And now if you have that all set up, if you run it, now I have a cat instead of a, for my button. And now if I type in meow, click on the cat, it will say meow. Uh, and it's, that has nothing to do with the cat. If I said rough, it doesn't matter what I type in. It's still going to type that up there. But now you can have buttons that have images on them uh, rather than just text.